What's up, everyone? It's Mike Bendy from Federa Guitars. I'm here with Mr. Joey Loricella. How you doing today, Joey? Great, great. Just getting back. Had a little holiday vacation. Uh, yeah. Was upstate New York and uh, got a chance to chill out and take some time off. Uh, it feels great to be back with everybody here. So what are you holding there? That looks pretty exciting. Kind of looks like your bass. It looks like, yeah, it does. It has, uh, it has a lot of features of my bass that I've been playing for the past, say... Since 97, since right? Since 97. This bass is from 1997. And uh, this I've done, like, just about all of my gigs that I've been doing, playing out and playing, you know, playing club dates and playing clubs and playing and doing some recording sessions or whatever. And this has been my main, that's my main bass. That's, and I, I love it to death and I've been playing it every, you know, I play it every day. We were talking about maybe making something that has some of the features from my personal bass in this, in, uh, in, an, in a model. And we came up with the, this instrument that I'm holding right here, which, which is a great, I mean, it's a tribute to me, it's an honor that the, that we talked about doing this for many years and we finally got around to doing it. I think we nailed it. I mean, it sound, sounds, it feels great. Really excited about it, excited to get it out there and, and put it to work and uh, run it to its paces. All the guys here that, you know, everybody's been playing it and they all love it. So we're hoping that we can get it out to you guys and have you guys check it out. So is it is it safe to say that this is a true war workhorse? Yeah, yeah, this is the meat and potatoes workhorse. That's what this is. The this Italian is, stallion. Yeah, you take it out, you take it out of the bag, and, and uh, my base, I take it out of the bag and I put it on. I don't think about it. I just love having it strapped on. And I don't have to think about the bass. I could think more about the music and what I'm playing and having a good time. So that's what I feel a, a great instrument is about. And uh, I feel my instrument, I play all the, every instrument that we make here, they're all great instruments, you know, but they're all for certain people. Everybody has their, their recipe of what they love to play. And this is my recipe, this instrument right here. So speaking of recipe, can we talk about some of the specs of this amazing instrument? Yeah, my personal instrument right here has a northern ash body. The mech is maple. Also, it's got a bird's eye, bird's eye maple fingerboard, maple fingerboard. 22 frets on my instrument. And if you notice my instrument right here, my, my, my personal one has a ramp that I've got on there for about, just about five years now. A friend of mine that we built an instrument came up here and says, Joey, can you put a ramp on my bass? I said, a ramp? I said, you're not a ramp guy. He says, I'm a ramp guy. Put, can you put it on? So I said, yes. I put it on his bass. He said, do me a favor. After you do my bass, he goes, take my bass out and play it on a couple of gigs and let me know what you think. So I took his bass out, I took it out on a couple of dates with the ramp on it and loved it to death. Came back and said, I gotta have a ramp. And I put a ramp on his bass and I've had it on there for now. It's gotta be five, maybe six years now. And I just love it. And the good thing about this is that I have 22 frets. So if I'm gonna do the thumb thing, I have room to get in there and play. And then when I wanna do the finger thing, I have, you know, it's all, everything's there. This instrument is going to be available with the ramp or what you know. You can buy it. You know, you can get it with a ramp or without a ramp. You know, not everybody wants a ramp, but I think if you try it, you're probably going to like it. So why do you like ash? I just love the tone. I love the tone of it. You know, it's kind of got this a little bit of mid range built into the wood. You know, the ash has this like lower mid that you need to uh, to cut through the sauce. You know, like when you're playing. Yeah. And the notes are really pronounced without being you know, like without getting in anybody's way, but they have it, it gives them a little natural definition of, the, of themselves, you know. And it's a bolt on, you know, the right. instrument is a bolt on. Packs a punch. My instrument's a bolt on. I love the, I love the, the way the bolt ons feel and the way they sound. Not that the neck two bodies and the dovetail, they all have something special about them, but the, uh, for me, this is, this works, you know. I have, I have a, I've had a neck two body five string that I played for many years before I got this one. You can make them do whatever you want them to do, you know, they, that's the great thing about the instruments, you know, but the bolt-ons always work for me. It just feels good, sounds good, you know. The pickup spacing is, is 70s pickup spacing. It's got two single coil Seymour Duncan pickups in it that, uh, that Kevin Bella wound for me like many, many years. A lot of friends and a lot of customers that come here and that they've they say, hey, I really love that bass, I love how it sounds. So I tell, you know, I turn them on to it. And they wind up getting an instrument with this formula. And it kind of works well for a lot of people. 
Yeah, it certainly does. It's very popular combination of woods. I love the translucent cream. You kind of see the grain of the ash coming through. You got a perloid pick guard on there. You got 19 millimeter spacing. And we have the standard three band EQ. So dialing in that tone, depending on what room you're at, what situation, studio, all the tones are gonna be there. Also has the matching cream headstock, which is money right there. We kind of captured the look of my instrument in this instrument. I know me personally, knowing you since I was a, a young man, all the years of knowing you, it's, it's a real honor to finally see this come to life. Yes. So I'm, I'm very proud, it's a proud moment for me working with the greatest company in the world for their guitars. I'm looking forward to see this one take off.